Hey everyone, I just wanted to show you the uh, vinyl release of uh, the previously uh, released CD of Van Morrison's Beyond Words Instrumental. This is the 2LP set, uh, available exclusively only from Orange Field Records. And that's only available on Van's website. So if you want to get a copy of this, you have to go on Van's website, go to the store, and it's uh, under Orange Field Records. Um, has his uh, regular releases there, but uh, this is uh, exclusive only on Van's uh, website. I do not believe you can get it anywhere else. Uh, somebody let me know if, you, if it is available someplace else, but I don't, I think... I think there's a record store in England that might have it, uh, uh, but uh, I think they're connected to Orangefield Records. But uh, best bet if you want this, go to Van's website and order it. Um, the um, the LP is uh, like I said, it's two LPs on vinyl. Uh, it gives you basically the same information you got on the CD, the title of the songs, and the personnel that were on the tracks. Doesn't give recording dates, um, but you can sort of deduce where the uh, the the, uh, the time of the tracks that, when they're recorded um, by the personnel on there. If you're really into that type of thing, a lot of the tracks were recorded during the inarticulate feature of the heart sessions, which uh, I heard uh, from somebody years ago that there was a lot of stuff recorded during those sessions. So. Uh, it would appear a lot of them were instrumental and they made their way onto the album on onto uh, um, onto this and I still think there's probably more that were recorded and are out there so maybe we'll see those later there's a bit of a, a shine off the uh, the uh, the instruments on here which is nice uh, this is a regular matted feel of a record, but this has a little glossy feel, so it's a little shine off of it, same here. So it's very nice. It's well uh, uh, put together. Um, you know, uh, the uh, packaging, the yeah. LPs come in these nice, uh, 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 thick paper. Uh, sleeves it's not flimsy um, so uh, it's uh, it's well put together uh, this is the LP this is uh, I think this is uh, LP1 and uh, good old black vinyl Is LP2, and I think it's going to look a lot like LP1. So, uh, all the tracks that uh, uh, were on the CD are here on the vinyl. So, um, the sound on the uh, CD is great, and the uh, I assume the sound on the vinyl is just as good. It's a uh, the mastering was done very well, and uh, it's uh, Really enjoyable. Uh, I've been listening to this a lot. Um, you know, the last year was a lot. You had the Skiffle album, and then the uh, instrumental album. Then you had the Accentuate the Positive album, and so there's a lot of listening. So I, uh, I, I, I'm still listening to a lot to the Skiffle album, but um, I've been listening to this a lot more in the recent uh, month. So. Uh, um, Van put out a lot in the past few years, so you know, you gotta, it takes a while to drink it all in. But, um, like I said, this is only available on Exile Records, so, uh, or on Orangeville Records. Uh, so if you want it, you know, you have to go get it from Van's website. And, uh, you know, I, I'm glad he's releasing this on a vinyl LP, because that tells me that uh, they're investing in it and you're probably going to see more releases on this label and that they are uh, they're committed to releasing more stuff you know um i think it's so i think it's a good sign that they followed up the cd release with the vinyl release uh, they probably got a good enough response to the vinyl albums to the cd albums where they said we'll put on we'll release vinyl as well 
and you know it's a good from a fan's point of view it's a good investment because you uh, you're investing in the future releases from this label so um, hopefully we'll see many more releases from the uh, Orangefield Records uh, album Van has a lot of stuff that's in the vault and uh, I uh, love to see it come out. I don't think we're getting Philosopher Stone, Stone 2. I think instead we're going to get uh, released in different compilations like we're seeing with uh, Beyond uh, Beyond Words. So, uh, and, uh, so just be patient. You know, Van's still releasing original material. So, you know, I think, you know, He'll release the uh, archival stuff when it's uh, when there's no uh, original album to be released. And uh, Van seems to be cutting back on his gigs this year, so it's not surprising. Uh, I think um, he's done so many gigs in the past <laughs> few years that uh, I think now he's now cutting back to uh, maybe a schedule that he it's more manageable for him and uh, his team. Um, but he'll still be gigging. I don't think he's going to retire. Um, I just don't see that, but I'll, I do see less gigs. Um, so, uh, but we'll definitely see more original material and, uh, more archival releases. All right. Thanks for watching.